Good morning, welcome to the forecast discussion for Thursday, October 20th, 2022. And of course, today is the launch of our winter forecast. Just want to walk you through where to find it. First of all, if you are just a regular subscriber, you visit the site, you're in, in the public domain. Uh, the winter forecast can be found right here under this nice little you know, uh, link here. Uh, and you just click on that and it will take you right to the forecast right here. Uh, where it provides all the details uh, in terms of the overall basics of what to expect for this upcoming winter. And if you are a premium member, or if you would like to become a premium member, well, you just have to subscribe, and then the winter forecast is right here, and then you just click that link. And again, it downloads into this very nice PDF where we discuss more details into the uh, lifting parameters and the forcing parameters, and of course, the favorite aspect of what can go wrong because it's important to understand our limitations in any forecast and so this definitely goes under that aspect as well and of course the forecast down here which is uh, the same as the public version so let's talk about the weather conditions that are in place today of course tonight we'll have our live chat on the winter forecast so definitely join us at 8 p.m and check that out uh, currently, this morning, we have scattered cloud cover to clear skies with winds from the west-southwest around 5 to 10 miles per hour, times gusting up to 20 miles per hour. Temperatures range from the upper 30s to mid-40s over the interior, lower to mid-40s in your suburbs, and upper 40s to lower 50s in your urban areas and along the immediate coast. Taking a look at our latest surface map and radar, we continue to have our upper-level lows spinning up here over southeastern Canada, and that's sending little troughs through the region, but because of a lack of moisture in the atmosphere, not really producing much of anything, you could get a very rare flurry or, or isolated shower uh, passed through the Poconos and Catskills, but that is about it. Otherwise, it is tranquil weather conditions in place with clear skies for most of the region. Again, there's some clouds hanging off by the Poconos here with that trough. But for the most part, we can expect clear skies and sky cloud cover. With the cold air aloft, we will see some more cumulus pop up here as we go on through the day just because of the instability of the atmosphere. But other than that, pretty quiet. And when we take a look at the infrared satellite picture, there is our upper level low that will start to lift out of the region. Pretty much quiet all the way back to the Rockies. But you see this feature right back here. This is going to dive south and interact with this stalled cold front. And that is going to lead to some issues by the time we get to late in the weekend and into Monday. So let's dive into this forecast. For today, look for scattered cloud cover throughout the region. Temperatures will range from the lower to mid 50s over the northern interior and mid to upper 50s along the coast. For tonight into tomorrow morning, look for clear skies and winds from the southwest. Generally tranquil weather conditions with low temperatures ranging from the lower to mid 30s over the northern interior mid to upper 30s in your suburbs and upper 30s to lower 40s in your urban areas and along the immediate coast for tomorrow afternoon look for clear skies tranquil weather conditions a little bit warmer with high temperatures in the mid to upper 50s over the interior lower to mid 60s along the coast for saturday high pressure remains off the coast with a nice southwesterly wind and sky cloud cover low temperatures will range from the lower to mid 40s high temperatures will range from the lower to mid 60s over the interior mid to upper 60s along the coast on sunday that area low pressure will slowly drift northward towards the region with increasing cloud cover and showers towards the evening look for low temperatures to range from the lower to mid 40s over the interior upper 40s to lower 50s in the suburbs and lower to mid 50s along the immediate coast high temperatures will range from the lower to mid 60s throughout the region on monday that area low pressure will continue to lift through the coastal waters with scattered showers expected look for low temperatures to range from the mid to upper 50s over the interior upper 50s to lower 60s along the coast high temperatures will range from the lower to mid 60s over the interior and mid to upper 60s along the coast on Tuesday, look for scattered cloud cover with an isolated shower lingering. Look for low temperatures to range from the lower to mid 50s, and high temperatures will range from 
the mid to upper 60s over the interior and upper 60s to lower 70s along the coast. A cold front will move through on Tuesday night into Wednesday morning with a few pesky showers followed by clearing skies in the afternoon. Look for low temperatures to range from the mid to upper 40s over the interior, lower to mid 50s along the coast. High temperatures will range from the upper 50s to lower 60s over the interior, lower to mid 60s along the coast. And on Thursday, high pressure will be in control with clear skies and tranquil weather conditions. Look for low temperatures in the upper 30s to lower 40s over the interior, mid to upper 40s along the coast. And high temperatures will range from the lower to mid 60s. That is your forecast discussion for today. I will see you tonight at 8 p.m. when we discuss the winter forecast. Looking forward to seeing you there. And as always, stay safe out there.